Hello and welcome to The Long View with me, John Jordan. Today I'm dipping back into Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. So it's a game I've been playing for a year and a half now since it came out. And playing it every day, pretty much still. Still enjoying it. And one thing that I really like to do is go into the squad arenas and uh, take on squads that have a Darth Vader character in them. Because my squad is led by Admiral Akbar, and Admiral Akbar has a really good attribute uh, which makes him excellent at taking out squads with Darth Vader's in. So I don't know, it gives me so much pleasure to do, to do this, I don't quite know why. Um, it just really appeals to me. Um, so I should say, I'm just playing with light-sided characters, so in the game you can choose dark side, light-sided characters. I just have a light-sided team, um, so that kind of also um, kind of affects my strategy. Um, so here we are in the, um, in the selection mode, so in the squad arena you get to choose um, three one of three uh, battles, um, like an easier, easy, easy, medium, and hard, I suppose. Um, although they're all ranked higher than you, so if you win any battle, um, your rank will go up. So I've got two options with Vader's in. Um, I'm actually going to choose the easier one, so the An Anrith, Erith, I guess. Um, I choose that squad. I like the look of that. It's got a Vader in it, and the rest of the characters look like they should be beatable. Um, so let's go off and play this. So select that. Um, here's my squad, as I say, all light-sided characters. Um, fairly lightweight, but fast and with good critical attack damage. So there's Akbar's just done his leader attack, or his leader attribute. And we're just going to cycle through. So I'm attacking the Royal Guard, which is a tank character. I hate tanks. Any squad with a tank, I think, is just like not playing fair, very boring. So let's take the, take the tank out first. Um, so you can see I've got some three Jedis and a Leia and Akbar. So you can see now, um, Vader's just done his Force Crush move, which has hit some of my characters with this um, negative negative um, status. Now, what Akbar's brilliant about is he has his It's a Trap, which dispels all neg negative status. And um, when it does that, the characters gain 9% of their maximum health for each status um, dispelled. So you can see here, you know, some of those are getting like 36%, some of my characters are getting 36% health boost. So it, it actually works like a little, like kind of healing almost. So I've actually lost my healer there, so that was uh, Luminara, it's been lost, but it doesn't really matter because all my characters are pretty much at maximum health anyway. And now it's just, it's a 4 on 2. You can see another interesting thing here with Leia, so Leia has this stealth mode that she goes into. So you can't see my Leia now, his Leia will probably just go into stealth mode. Um, I'm d doesn't really matter to me, I'm just going to um, keep taking out our Vader. There goes Leia into stealth mode. Um, and I've, I've got, you, know, you see my character there, one of them's got another um, negative status. Uh, but that doesn't really matter anymore because I'm so far in the lead. There we go. Now it's just time to uh, take out Leia. So we just see, just sighting through the different attacks basic attacks and then more complex attacks. There we go, victory! Nice easy victory there. Nice bit of levelling up and well done Admiral Akbar. Hello, thanks for watching right to the end of the video. If you have any comments, please put them in the comment box. We're always interested to hear what people think of our videos. Also, don't forget to subscribe. There's a button below and check out some of our other videos. There's two really good examples on the screen right now.